Do you remember when the uh, Huawei Watch 4 was released? Yes, two years ago. After such a uh, long wait, Huawei's 5th gen flagship watch has uh, finally hit the market. I'm sure people online have already told you how powerful the uh, Watch 5 is, but they uh, probably haven't explained why it's so powerful. Well, we just so happens to have received the uh, Watch 5 from Huawei and uh, they've shared a lot with us about the uh, design philosophy. Today, I will do my best to uh, break down the design thinking and the principles behind the new side sensor in the uh, simplest terms possible. This peel-shaped sensor module on the uh, side combines three sensors, an uh, ECG sensor, a uh, PPG sensor, and a uh, tactile sensor. By the way, this uh, tactile sensor is actually closer to what we usually call a uh, pressure sensor. It's uh, mainly used to assist the users in uh, performing health monitoring actions more accurately. When not used for health monitoring, it can also serve as a button that provides Watch 5 with an additional dimension of interaction. Huawei has named this entire side fingertip sensor XTAP. The side ECG and PPG sensor will become one of the cores of the TrueSense system, working together with the wrist sensor on the back of the watch to provide users with a highly precise data that surpasses all previous watches. So why such a uh, small additional sensor module achieve more accurate data measurement? This brings us to the uh, next action. Users of the uh, Watch 4 Pro or other high-end smartwatches should be very familiar with this action. Yes, by installing electrodes on the button or the crown, combining them with the uh, electrodes on the wrist, a uh, closed circuit is formed in the human body. Based on the uh, potential difference, it can uh, determine whether the user has uh, heart-related issues this is a single lead ECG technology. Since electrodes don't require any optical sensors, this is definitely not the reason for the birth of uh, XTAP. The LED lights in XTAP are actually the core components of the uh, PPG sensor. PPG stands for photoplithesmography, and its measurements are typically gained through a uh, pulse oximeter. The principle involves the LED emitting light into the bloodstream, which is then reflected back and received by a photodiode. Because each heartbeat causes changes in a capillary blood volume, the amount of hemoglobin affects the light absorption rate, allowing calculations of pulse rates, blood oxygen saturation, and pulse waveform data. In fact, if you flip over your smartwatch, you might sometimes see red or green lights flashing. That's the uh, PPG sensor found in uh, most watches. So why did Huawei go through all the uh, trouble developing XTAP on this side? The reason is simple. The wrist is extremely unfriendly for smartwatch sensors. First, skin tone affects light penetration. Darker skin weakens the light signal transmission, making the data less accurate. Additionally, the wrist has a low capillary density and a thicker skin, both of which interfere with the data collection. The way users wear the watch also significantly impacts accuracy, such as uh, how tightly it's worn, movement induces displacement, and uh, interference from uh, sweat and hair. These issues have long troubled traditional smartwatches. Clearly, XTAP is Huawei's ultimate solution to uh, those problems. First, XTAP's monitoring location is the uh, fingertip. The fingertip is an excellent PPG measurement site. It has a richer capillary, metaroid, and aroid, no interference from muscles or hair, and a thinner skin. That's why even the most common hospital-grade pulse oximeters use a finger clip design, proof that the finger is the best location for optical sensor measurement. The red light and infrared light on its left side is also carefully chosen. Red light and infrared light has a longer wavelength and a better penetration, enabling more accurate blood oxygen data. The trade-off is a higher power consumption, which would uh, make a continuous long-term monitoring impractical. The solution to a uh, high power consumption is uh, straightforward. Let the user decide when to measure. By pressing XTAP directly, you can activate health glands. The Watch 5 will then detect your heart rate, blood oxygen, and other data in real time. Combined with the long-term monitoring data from the wrist sensor, it provides a comprehensive health report within 60 seconds. This feature is also available on the GT5 series and is one of the key selling points of the TrueSense system. However, with the help of XTAP, the Watch 5's data accuracy reaches an even higher level. There is currently only one feature available to users in China, but I'll mention it anyway. Hypertension risk study without a cough. 
Thanks to the additional PPG sensor, it's now possible to measure two sets of pulse transmit time. The shorter the difference between these two sets of data, the faster the pulse wave velocity, indicating higher blood pressure. This is the fundamental principle behind cough-free hypertension risk monitoring. Compared to an upper arm blood pressure monitor, this method is far more convenient, making it extremely helpful for hypertension patients. It can promptly alert you to seek medical attention when abnormal blood pressure is detected. Because the hypertension risk study is led by universities and hospitals in China, it's reasonable for China to be the first to launch this feature. Huawei is also cooperating with global hypertension research institutions, so in the future, users worldwide may all have the opportunity to enjoy this function. While Huawei hasn't disclosed all the technologies involved due to confidential reasons, I suspect XTAP employs another method to blood pressure measurement. This approach resembles the osteometric method used by inflated cough upper arm blood pressure monitors. Here's how it likely works. Instead of an uh, inflated cuff, the uh, user's finger pressure on X-tap temporarily restricts artery blood flow. As pressure is uh, gradually released by reducing finger force, blood flow resumes, generating oscillometric waves. X-tap's PPG sensor records these oscillations to determine mean artery pressure. When combined with the pulse transit time differential measurement, this dual method approach could uh, significantly enhance accuracy. This hybrid model explains why Watch 5's accuracy reportedly rivals medical devices in uh, Huawei's lab tests. It is worth noting that the hypertension risk study without a cough isn't exclusive to Huawei. Other brands have also incorporated similar features in their smartwatches. However, none have managed to uh, miniaturize both ECG and PPG sensors to such an extent, often resulting in, well, less aesthetically pleasing designs. I would say Huawei's achievement in shrinking these two sensors while adding a pressure sensor into such a compact form is truly remarkable. To fit all three sensors into a space no larger than a soybean, there are many awesome manufacturing techniques also. For instance, they use electroplating to apply the ECG conductive coating onto a transparent integrated hot bent glass, ensuring efficient electrical and optical signal transmission. The tactile sensor in XTAP boasts ultra-high pressure resolution capable of uh, detecting over 10 distinct pressure levels with extreme precision. The measurement range operates within a uh, macroscopic deformation range of uh, just 0.07 mm, which is about 10% the uh, diameter of a uh, human hair, accurately quantifying pressure forces between 0 to uh, 200 grams. This level of uh, integration not only enhances functionality but also uh, maintains the uh, watch's sleek design a feat that set Huawei apart in the wearable tech space. Beyond health monitoring, Huawei has added unique interactive features to XTAP. In addition to one-tap activation of a health glands, Huawei has committed to opening this sensor to third-party developers in the future. Game developers could leverage it to create fun mini-games for the watch. If you have watched this entire video patiently till this moment, you'll realize Huawei is not just uh, turning this uh, flagship smartwatch into a uh, super convenient standalone device for everyday use, but also putting a lot of effort into uh, health monitoring, constantly refining its features to make it a portable, intelligent health monitoring tool as well. If I say Huawei watches are already the uh, best in the world, you might disagree. But in terms of uh, health monitoring, it's hard to find anything better than a Huawei watch. The Watch 5 has truly reached a uh, new pinnacle for the uh, series. If you are like me and uh, deeply care about uh, tracking your health, the uh, Huawei Watch 5 is uh, practically unbeatable in this regard. If you're interested, don't forget to uh, check it out on their official website. This is Will from China. See you next time.